I'm being adopted by my ex-girlfriend's family? Mom, Dad, no. Please, come on. You can't be serious. Oh, we're serious, Olivia. Yes, darling. After what happened to his parents, we know he has nowhere else to go. We can't leave him like this. Kyle's a great kid. He deserves more than living in the orphanage. Exactly. And that's why we'll be adopting him. Ah! Ah! Oh, man. It's just a dream again. Kyle, are you awake? I'll be right there. What is it, Mrs. Smith? Kyle, I was wondering if you could give me a hand, please? Yeah, of course. Thank you. I'm making this wonderful dinner and Olivia's nowhere to be found. <laughs> She's not really great in the kitchen anyway. That's okay. I actually love cooking. What? You do? Oh, that's fantastic. Olivia, this is absolutely outrageous. I think I should go check this out, make sure Olivia's okay. Is everything all right out here? No, actually nothing's all right. Well, we can hear you guys arguing from inside. Just shut up and watch your mouth, loser. Yeah, Kyle, this isn't really about you. Ryan and I are just having a disagreement. So can you just like mind your own business? Kind of hard when you guys are just shouting at the top of your lungs. What did you just say? Dude, just back off, okay? Ha ha, I'm not gonna back off, you stupid loser. Ow. You don't belong here in this house. You should just move out. Oh man, I can't believe it. Another zombie attack in space movie? <laughs> I haven't seen these since I was a kid. Yeah, it looked pretty fun. Thanks for taking me out to the movies, Mr. Smith. Of course, Kyle. After everything that you went through, I figured you'd need this to, you know, lift up your spirits. I appreciate it, but I'm fine. I know what it's like to lose your parents. Both mine passed away a long time ago. I know how much it hurts, so... I hope this just helps you feel better. Thanks again, Mr. Smith. Dad, what are you doing with Kyle? Olivia, I was just taking Kyle out to the movies. Dad, but why wouldn't you take me? I'm your daughter. Well, you've been saying how you want nothing to do with Kyle, so... Well, yeah, I don't, but I'm your daughter. You should be spending time with me. Maybe this wasn't a good idea, Mr. Smith. No, absolutely not. Olivia's just being dramatic. No, I'm not, Dad. Kyle's not even a part of our family. Hey, you better watch it, young lady. No, she's right. I think I'll just leave. Wow. I had no idea Olivia had such a big family. Thanksgiving's never felt like this before. I mean, now I don't even have my own family. Kyle, honey, is everything okay? Uh, I think I just need a minute. K Kyle! <laughs> Mom and dad are gone. <laughs> this is the most pain I've ever felt in my life. I feel so alone. Kyle, are you crying? Yeah. I am. Is everything okay? No, Olivia, it's not okay. My life just doesn't feel real anymore. <laughs> My gosh, you're so dramatic. Like, get over it. Like, I'm supposed to just get over my parents being gone. You have no idea what it's like. Yeah, and no one in here really cares because we're all trying to have a good time. So why don't you just go? You know what? Fine, I will go. I'm sorry for ruining your perfect holiday, Olivia. If they don't want me here, fine. I won't be around them anymore. Kyle, what are you doing? I'm leaving. Just get out of my way. Oh, 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 no. You're not going anywhere. What happened? It was Olivia, wasn't it? It most definitely was. We're putting an end to it. Olivia! Olivia, get down here! Uh, yeah? You have been absolutely awful to Kyle the past few days. Yes, you need to apologize to him. No, I'm not going to apologize until he does. Listen, Olivia, I'm sorry it didn't work out between us, and I'm sorry I hurt you, okay? But I don't have a choice where I'm living now, now that my family is gone. That's right. Kyle really needs some help right now, and he is a good person. Yes, Olivia, find a little kindness in your heart. Why should I? I don't feel like it. Young lady, you need to get used to Kyle living here because he's not going anywhere. Hey, Mrs. Smith, what's going on? Kyle, I got a little surprise for you. What? This is for me? Yes, it's a brand new car. We're proud of you for getting a job. Wow, this is a really big gift. 
Well, you deserve it. You need a way to get to work, don't you? I do. I'm used to just walking everywhere, though. Well, now you don't have to. Mom, what's this new car? Oh, it's a little something for Kyle. What? No, are you serious? You bought my ex-boyfriend a car? Yes, he needed a little encouragement. Are you serious? He needed encouragement, so you dropped like thousands of dollars on a new car? This is ridiculous. He's not even family. This isn't fair. Oh boy. Maybe you should take back the car. No, it, it'll be fine. But Olivia seemed so upset. That's fine. She'll get over it. We're happy for you, Kyle. What do you mean he hasn't left yet? Olivia, you're living with your ex-boyfriend. Yeah, it's not really my ideal situation, but I have to deal with it. I think your parents like him more than they like me, and I'm your boyfriend. I don't know what to do. I can't help that. There's only one thing you can do, Olivia, and that's to move out. Move out? But where would I go? I don't know. You'll be able to figure it out. I can't really just figure it out. I mean, I don't want to leave my family. Olivia, you have to choose. You can either be happy with me or be miserable with your ex-boyfriend and your family. Olivia, what's going on? Well, hope you're happy. I'm moving out. What? You're just moving out? Where are you going to go? Yeah, did I stutter? I'm leaving here. You're ruining my life. Olivia, you're being irrational. No, you broke up my family. Olivia, I didn't do anything. Yes, you did. This is all your fault, Kyle. Oh, I can't believe this. <laughs> she just left. What do you mean she just left? She's gone. She moved out. She doesn't want to be here anymore. But why? Well, she didn't even say goodbye to us. Mr. and Mrs. Smith, I'm really sorry. All of this is my fault. You know what, Kyle? You might be right. Maybe this kind of is your fault. Everything was fine. Olivia seemed really happy until Kyle came back in the picture. Jim, you don't mean it. My daughter just moved out of my house without even saying goodbye to me. I can't even stand looking at you, Kyle. I'm sorry, Mr. Smith. I'm sorry. I think I just need to go. Kyle, no. This isn't your fault. Clearly, it is my fault, Mrs. Smith. I appreciate everything you've done for me, but I need to go. Kyle? Ki Kyle, wait! Kyle, what are you doing here? I just came here to tell you, you should go back home. No, leave me alone. Listen, I'm sorry for everything, okay? I'm sorry for coming back into your life and causing stress with your family. I know why you don't want to be around me. I'm glad you finally realized you ruined my life. I didn't do it on purpose, okay, Olivia? I'm really, really sorry. Well, sorry doesn't fix what you've done, okay? I'm leaving your parents' house. You should go back home and be with them. Hmm. Well, maybe if you promise to never come back. Olivia, what's going on? What is Kyle doing here? He's here to apologize for ruining my life. You've hurt Olivia enough, Kyle. You should just get out of here. I'm really sorry for everything, Olivia. I'm sorry for being a bother and ruining your life. Bye, loser. See you never. Mom, Dad, I miss you guys so much. I really wish you were here. I feel so lost without you. And I have no one now. I'm just on my own. Hey, Kyle. Olivia, what are you doing here? I'm sorry. I, I was too harsh. I know you're going through a rough time right now, and I shouldn't be this way. I feel like my head is just being thrown against a thousand walls, you know? Yeah, I can't even really imagine. But then I came into your life and started ruining things with your family. Yeah, I mean, it's a pretty awkward situation. I know, it was weird, but I didn't really have a choice. They just wanted to help me. I shouldn't have been so worked up. You do get kind of worked up sometimes. Well, look, can we call a truce? I'd really like that. I honestly miss being your friend, Olivia. Yeah, maybe we should try this whole friends thing. Ugh, Ryan, what do you want? I want you to stay away from my girlfriend. What are you even talking about? I know you're trying to get back together with her. No, I'm not. Trust me, Olivia and I don't belong together. That's right, you don't. And you don't belong in her family either. Dude, just leave me alone, okay? You're a nobody and you have nobody. Literally no one cares about you. How does that feel? No, just shut up, okay? It's not true. You don't have a real family anymore. I do have a real family and I can have a new family too. 
Yo, Kyle, I hate you so much. Well, I don't really like you either, Ryan. I wanted to do this for a long time. You've had this coming. Stop it. Oh, shut up. Olivia, what are you doing? Are we going on vacation or something? No, I'm leaving. No way, you're not leaving. Yeah, I am, Ryan. I heard about what you did. What, I beat up your pathetic ex-boyfriend? It was easy. Yeah, exactly that. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Why are you siding with Kyle? I'm not siding with Kyle. You don't just beat people up. I hate Kyle and his stupid, ugly face. He deserved everything that was coming to him. You know what? I'm done with you. We're breaking up. Seriously? You want to break up with me? Yeah, and it's not because of Kyle. I hate the way you treat everyone around you. Whatever, Olivia. I never really loved you in the first place. Your parents are so happy that you're home now, Olivia. I know, it, it's great. I'm happy to be back. Well, I think then it's time for me to go. But where are you gonna go? Well, I've been working really hard and I saved enough money. I think I can get my own place. Really? That's awesome. Yeah, I appreciate your family helping me get back on my feet, but I can do this on my own now.